Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be sharing some items that I got from the 21 Days of Beauty sale. I didn't get a lot of stuff, but some items that I did get, I've been wanting for a while, but I didn't at the time wanted to purchase these items, but better late than never, right? And the perfect opportunity is a 50% off sale. So with that being said, if you like this, I don't know why I'm talking with my hands. If you would like to see what I got in this sale, please keep watching. So the first items that I purchased are the New Sticks Conceal Pencil Crayons and this is what they look like. Hopefully that's, yeah, New Sticks. And I have them in the color Medium 6, Deep 7, and Deep 8. This is the packaging. It comes with a mirror with instructions. But they're concealer, so you do what you will. Me personally, I'm gonna use them probably to outline my eyebrows, maybe contour my nose, we'll see. Let me swatch. This is the packaging. This one is medium six. And this is the jumbo pencil. And this is actually my fall edition, I would like to call it, for this Ulta sale, because I did one in the spring. Um, moving on. <laughs> this is Deep 7. And this is Deep 8, which I'll probably try to use to contour my nose. But we shall see. Moving on, this is the Goof Proof Brow Pencil, and I got the color 4.5 and the number 5. This is the packaging here. This is the spoolie. And then this is the pencil side. And let's see how this bad boy works. Oh no, this is very drying. I like my pencils a little bit more creamier, but I won't discredit it right now. It's gonna be a work in progress. We'll see how it works. All these products, of course, I will use in upcoming videos and I'll kind of keep you posted. And moving on, this is the Tarte Busy Gal Brows. Tinted brow gel in the color medium brown. I think it, this is the packaging here. It's pretty. It says Double Duty Beauty. We'll see about that. Oh, and this is 12 hours waterproof, by the way. This is the spoolie, it's super skinny. I don't know if you could tell. So we'll see. It's tiny. Moving on to face products. This, I've already opened this stuff so it could be a little bit easier to show. This is the Becca Ever Matte Poreless Priming Perfector. And this is what it looks like. It comes in a little squeezy tube. Let's put a little bit on our hand. Let's see. Yeah, this is gonna be very, very matte. But it looks like it helps smooth out your skin. Yeah, this is super matte, guys, so I don't know. I'm combination skin, I think. I don't know if it's because of the summer, it's sweat, or is it really oil? I guess we'll find out in the upcoming fall and winter months and see how my skin does. But so far, I think, I wanna say my skin is changing to combination. We'll see. Moving on, this is the Urban Decay All Nighter Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray. Scandinavia actually makes um, this setting spray, which is a really good brand of setting spray. So if you wanted to try something different, try Scandinavia. They're really, really good. 
and this is the packaging and this is four ounces and it says up to 16 hour wear lightweight temperature control technology and then ooh, it comes with another top in case you lose this one super convenient and I actually got two I needed a backup you can never have enough setting spray all right so the next product is a moisturizer from Clinique is 72 hour auto replenishing hydrator and this is the packaging it's so so pretty it's like a peachy color and let's see if it has a oof. let's see if it has a smell comes with the little protector nope no smell but let's test the product off I'll just put a little bit on my hand it's clear and we'll put it here Ooh, yeah I can see why it's hydrating it feels like water and it makes your skin smooth so could you imagine on your face that I cannot wait to try I think I'm gonna try this tomorrow morning and see how I like it let's see next oh last but not least I love Buxom lip glosses. They're my all-time favorite lip glosses, like Holy Grail status. Um, in their previous spring sale that they had, I bought a lot of colors from them. So I wanted to try their shiny liquid lip li shiny liquid lipstick in the color brown, but it's made me watch or make me melt is the name of the color, but it's a brown. So let's see what it looks like. This is the applicator. Let's put it here. Ooh, that's pretty. It doesn't look brown though. It kind of looks burgundy. So I don't know why they're calling it brown. Interesting. But yeah, never. Uh, I cannot talk guys I'm so sorry anyways I don't know why they call it this brown it doesn't look brown or maybe it's my lighting I don't know but looking at it it looks more burgundy than brown but hey to each his own all right guys I believe that concludes my haul video thank you so much for watching and taking the time out out of your day to spend with me but yeah thank you so much again please don't forget to rate comment and subscribe go ahead and hit that notification button that way you're notified of my next video which I'm not sure what my next video is going to be but you will see me soon for sure I do apologize about the lighting I have a ring light so I'm thinking it wasn't the best idea to use it today maybe just I should have went with natural lighting but I don't know I think it's like six o'clock so yeah I'm gonna stop rambling because I have nothing else to say so yeah bye